Just a quick video here showing you just a painting tip for me, painting baseboards. Now this is just a, a three inch or two and three quarter inch baseboard. So I like to use the inch and a half brushes, um, a good inch and a half brush, get about that much paint on. You can see I've rolled some of the wall color onto the wall, but uh, I haven't done the, the brush work down to it because I find this is just a lot quicker to get a coat on the trim before I do the brushwork. Now, if you're a do-it-yourselfer, then you may want to make sure you put a drop cloth down. If I get a drip on this floor, I can easily just clean it up with my finger. But um, if you're not too comfortable with that, then, because I don't drip too much, um, then you want to make sure that you put a drop cloth down. Um, also, if you aren't too comfortable doing it freehand, like I am, then you might want to put some tape along the bottom. But the whole idea here is just getting this top all coated, well, the whole baseboard. But the main thing is to get that top part where it meets up against the wall. Because then once that's dry, then it's much easier to um, do your brushing of a color along the top of the baseboard. Or at least that's what I find. Um, now at the very end, of the job, I will sometimes just go along and just run the brush along the top just in case I had any splatters from the, the wall color get onto the baseboard. But it's definitely easier to do it this way. So there, once that's dry, then I will um, put another coat on and then let that dry. And then I'll do my brushing of the wall color and then I'll do my second full coat on the wall. Um, so a second coat of brushing it on and then rolling it. And then, like I said, at the very end, I will take my brush and just turn it on its edge with very little paint on it and just drag it along the top, which gives me a nice straight line. I have other videos that I show how I do that. Um, and that'll just clean up if any splatter does get on from the rolling. Now, the other thing you could do is just protect it with a little bit of painter's tape um, when you're doing your, your rolling of the wall. But um, either or, uh, either, either way works good. So hopefully that helps. Thanks for watching.